Hey guys, welcome back. So guys, this is the last video of this PHP block series. And now guys, in this video, we'll be see, seeing about your admin logout. And one, just I wanted to show that logged in as a, the logged in username. And we will modify this navbar. That's it guys. Let's move to our admin dashboard. So let's go inside admin dashboard let's go to includes and here we find our top navbar so i'm going to change first the navbar design guys so at the bg dark let's make it to primary and refresh perfect so we are getting the navbar as a primary color and over here is a logout button so when we click logout it should log out like here so when we click logout it logs out right so for this case guys you are going to make it over here also so let's move to the front end okay so includes navbar where you can find that your logout button is over here so let's copy this code logout button Control c and go back to your admin logout place so here is the logout button paste here so all set now you just need to remove this class and add it over here or else it's the same class so not an issue let's remove it save and i don't want these two three things and now let's refresh there you get one logout button perfect so when you click on this it should log out successfully so guys right now you are in a navbar top which is inside the includes folder and this file is called in all the pages okay so you you need to move one step back that is from your admin okay let's go one step back to from the admin and it goes to allcode.php okay so inside allcode.php we have the logout button all set let's move and now let's refresh and now guys i'm going to log out so let's click log out perfect logged out successfully and let's try to access admin here log into access dashboard so let's log in as a super admin with at gmail.com and the password perfect welcome to dashboard and here we go okay so now guys uh, who has logged in you want to see show in your dashboard so you can show either at this place or else you can show at here also so let's try to show on both places so first let's see as in the front end we have done that the logged in user name is visible over here right so let's copy the code from there itself okay so let's go to front end navbar perfect here is the code guys so let's copy this and before that you have to copy that if it is logged in or not so obviously if you're not logged in you should not enter the dashboard so no issue let's copy directly and go to tap navbar top navbar and this is our icon at the navbar so user icon and after that icon i just want to show this save let's refresh perfect so you are getting the name over here if you want you can increase text white refresh perfect so if you don't require this you can just remove this form so i'm just going to comment right now save refresh okay all set so now guys you can show the same format the name you want to show over here also so logged in as your current logged in username so let's copy this and move to the sidebar at the bottom of your sidebar here is the code paste it refresh perfect so if you want to give the like if it is not logged in please 
don't show that so you can just use the same code if else part copy and get back to the sidebar and and if and if all set let's control s and you can see the output perfect so guys we have successfully completed and we are finishing with this series guys let's see you in next video so thank you for watching this video guys please subscribe like and share